What's up? You rocking with your boy Chris, the expert bowler at Expert Bowler Gaming. I was at home today and I was cleaning some of my bowling equipment up and I decided, hey, this might be something that's useful for you all. Some people ask questions sometimes like, how do I maintenance my equipment? What type of ball cleaners do I use? So here you go. Here's the answer. Let's get into the video. All right. So if you want to know what products I use, I use cleaning products specifically designed for bowling balls by creating a difference. Um, the ball cleaner I use is that wow factor ball cleaner. Uh, it's their strongest ball cleaner to date. Um, that's why I use it. It comes in a nice spray top, um, really simple spread on the ball, wipe it off using the power pad. Um, works amazing. The original ball cleaner they made, probably what they're most famous for is called that purple stuff. Uh, it initially was made to use while you were bowling to help to maintain your ball reaction and keep your ball clean while you were bowling. So the power pad actually has a membrane in the middle. You would squirt that on the pad and wipe your ball off every shot. The backing is waterproof, so it keeps your hand from getting wet while the liquid would still be retained into the towel instead of uh, like using a regular like microfiber cloth or something like that where the, the liquid would just seep through and your hand would get wet. Um, but the power pad was the best option. It would keep the liquid in, you wipe your ball off, but since you can't do that anymore, they created a stronger before and after use cleaner. Um, but I use this Wow Factor Ball Cleaner in conjunction with the So Fresh and So Clean Ball Life Extender and the Scuff Mark Remover, the CTD Scuff Mark Remover. So I got a bowling ball here and I'll show you kind of how I go about cleaning my equipment off. Let's get into it. All right, so we'll take a look at the ball. The ball's pretty dirty. It's getting kind of beat up. This is my Zenith by Brunswick. It's one of the stronger balls in my arsenal. Um, but as you can see, right, it's pretty dirty. So one of the things I'll do first is I'll take some Wow Factor ball cleaner, right? And I'll just liberally spray it on the ball. I'm gonna take this spot right here and I'll take my power pad, right? And then We'll wipe it off. So as you can see, the ball got a little cleaner just from doing that. But there are some scuff marks on this ball, right? That are right here in the area. So as you can see, I've wiped it and I've tried to clean it, but I can't get those scuff marks off, right? Those scuff marks are still there. Um, but the ball did get a little bit cleaner. So. What do we do? We want our ball to look good. We want to get the scuff marks off. We'll use some So Fresh, So Clean. And we'll use that along with the scuff mark remover. So I've been using this one. It doesn't really matter which side you use. Uh, we'll liberally spray the scuff mark remover. All right, with the So Fresh So Clean, because it doesn't work if it's dry. The only way it works is if it's wet. We'll hit the ball where the scuff marks are. We'll let it sit there for a few seconds, right? Lubricate it, try to help to break it down. But we got our scuff mark remover. We got our ball with our scuff mark with the So Fresh So Clean on it. It's a pretty good scuff mark. We'll try to knock her out. Uh-oh. That part's getting a little beat up there. I was wondering why it wasn't really working like that. But as you can see, right, we're breaking the scuff mark up. I really didn't spray this side good. I sprayed the other side good, which is obviously the side that I'm always using, <laughs> which is why it's breaking apart. But the scuff mark remover is designed to break apart like that so that 
even if a part breaks off, you don't have to throw it away. You could continue to use it. Get a little bit of that out of there. This kind of sucks where the scuff mark was, right? It was like right in my thumb hole. But it's all right. It won't really affect anything. It's just the thumb hole. So let's get a little more lubrication here. Let me use this side right here. I have a fresh side of it too, but something about when it's that fresh white. I always like seeing it when it's the fresh white. So I'll try not to use that side until I absolutely have to. But we're breaking that. You can actually see, look. Let's see if you can see that. How it's lifting the scuff mark up right here. Look at that. How it's actively breaking it up. And we'll work it. And we'll get that scuff mark off. So that's definitely not a scuff mark right there. That's definitely like impacted into the cover stock. It's like dirt. Cause it broke up the rest of it, but just this little other part, it couldn't break up. So we had to help it out a little bit, but that's okay. Ball cleaner alone will not get that off. Typically, you'd have to sand the ball. Oh, get some of that juice out of there. All right, so let's wipe it off. All right. So we'll wait a second, let it dry off. So as you can see, that scuff mark is basically gone. This is a little remnants of it, but this is like impacted into the ball. The only way I could get this off is by sanding it. That's not coming out. But the rest of it is gone. So that's what I'll do. I use that, clean the ball, spray some ball cleaner on there, wipe it off. So the best part about using the so fresh and so clean is that it has an additive in it, which is called a tackifier, which helps to increase the lifespan and performance of your bowling ball over time. So over time, that tackifier will go into the cover of your ball and it will increase and maintain the tackiness of that ball. So you can see the sections where I use these so fresh, it's really, really tacky, all right? This one, not as much. Right here, it's much more tacky. So if you wanna keep your ball clean, make sure you get some of that Wow Factor ball cleaner along with the so fresh, so clean ball life extender and a true cut bowling ball scuff mark remover from CTD. If you want to know where to get them, check the description below, ctdbowling.com. The link will be below in the description. Go over there, visit the website, get you some products, help keep your ball clean.